Welcome to the enigmatic world of suspense, where shadows dance and tales unfold under the watchful eye of the master of suspense himself, Alfred Hitchcock. When did you first find yourself drawn into the captivating narratives spun by this iconic 1955 TV series? Perhaps it was a quiet evening by the television, or maybe a chance encounter with a rerun that left you hooked. Alfred Hitchcock presents a timeless anthology of mystery and intrigue has left an indelible mark on generations of viewers. Its unique format, featuring standalone stories helmed by Hitchcock's inimitable introductions, set the stage for an immersive journey into the depths of human nature. As you reflect on the impact of this series on your own life, are there personal stories that come to mind? Has it stirred your imagination or influenced your perspective on suspenseful storytelling? Before we delve further into the labyrinth of memories, let's uncover a few intriguing facts about Alfred Hitchcock Presents. Did you know that each episode was a self-contained narrative, often concluding with a twist that left audiences both astounded and delighted? The show's anthology format allowed Hitchcock to explore a myriad of genres, showcasing his directorial prowess across a spectrum of thrilling tales. Now, let's turn the spotlight to you, dear reader. What's your most cherished memory or personal experience related to Alfred Hitchcock Presents? We're eager to hear your stories, reflections, and the impact this iconic series has had on your life. Share your thoughts in the comments below and become a part of the narrative tapestry that this show continues to weave. So, when was the first time you found yourself ensnared in the suspenseful embrace of Alfred Hitchcock Presents? Can you recall a personal story that resonates with the enduring impact of this classic series? Share your memories below and let's celebrate the timeless allure of Hitchcock's tales. Alfred Hitchcock presents a classic television series that aired in the mid-20th century, seamlessly blended suspense, drama, and dark humor under the masterful direction of the iconic filmmaker Alfred Hitchcock. Premiering in the mid-1950s, the show became a pioneering force in the realm of anthology series, showcasing standalone stories with unexpected twists that left viewers on the edge of their seats. Hitchcock, the renowned director of suspenseful films, lent his distinctive silhouette and dry wit as the host, introducing each episode with a sardonic charm that became synonymous with the series. The show's anthology format allowed for diverse narratives, ranging from crime mysteries to psychological thrillers, all united by a common thread of Hitchcock's unique storytelling prowess. Characters, often ordinary individuals, thrust into extraordinary situations, navigated through moral dilemmas and unforeseen consequences, captivating audiences with their dilemmas. This blend of Hitchcock's signature suspenseful storytelling, coupled with the timeless allure of its morally ambiguous tales, cemented Alfred Hitchcock Presents as a cultural phenomenon influencing subsequent generations of television and film. Its impact is evident in the enduring popularity of anthology series and the lasting legacy of Alfred Hitchcock as a master of suspense, making the show a milestone in the history of television. Alfred Hitchcock, a master of suspense in the realm of mid-20th century television, left an indelible mark with the groundbreaking anthology series. In its later seasons, the show underwent a transformation, expanding its runtime to 60 minutes and adopting the moniker The Alfred Hitchcock Hour. This shift allowed for a deeper exploration of gripping narratives within each episode. Notably, Hitchcock's influence extended beyond the screen. The iconic film Psycho was originally conceived as an episode for the series. Utilizing the sets, cameras, and crew from Alfred Hitchcock Presents, the production of Psycho showcased the seamless integration between the small and big screen under Hitchcock's guidance. Further showcasing Hitchcock's hands-on involvement, he directed 17 episodes, each a testament to his storytelling prowess. From Revenge to Bang, You're Dead, these episodes exemplify the series' ability to weave suspense, drama, and dark humor into standalone tales, captivating audiences and solidifying its cultural significance. Alfred Hitchcock's impact on television and film endures, with Alfred Hitchcock Presents serving as a milestone in the history of suspenseful storytelling. The series evolving into the Alfred Hitchcock Hour and contributing to the creation of iconic films remains a testament to Hitchcock's lasting legacy in the world of entertainment. Alfred Hitchcock's dual role as entertainer and film director took center stage in the mid-20th century television series. The show, which began in the 1950s, not only showcased Hitchcock's mastery of suspenseful storytelling, but also marked a pivotal moment in his career. 
As a testament to his versatility, Hitchcock, initially known for his work as an illustrator of silent movie title cards, drew the distinctive silhouette featured in the opening credits of the series. The influence of sponsors on the show's presentation was noteworthy. Sponsors wielded considerable influence, particularly in episodes where the perpetrator seemingly got away with a crime. In these instances, Hitchcock, in his closing monologue, provided a statement to assure audiences that justice was served. This dynamic between artistic vision and commercial considerations added an intriguing layer to the series. Beyond its impact on television, the show played a crucial role in establishing Alfred Hitchcock as more than just a film director. It solidified his position as an entertainer, transcending the boundaries of the silver screen. The success of the series also resonated in Hitchcock's later projects, including the iconic film Psycho, originally conceived as an episode for the series. The seamless integration of sets, cameras, and crew from Alfred Hitchcock Presents into the production of Psycho highlighted Hitchcock's hands-on involvement and the interconnectedness of his works. In conclusion, the 1955 television series served as a significant chapter in Alfred Hitchcock's career, showcasing his evolution from a silent movie illustrator to a multifaceted entertainer and director. The delicate balance between artistic expression and commercial considerations evident in the show's dynamic with sponsors further emphasized Hitchcock's lasting impact on the world of suspenseful storytelling. The haunting melodies of Funeral March for a Marionette by Charles Gounod set the tone for Alfred Hitchcock's gripping television series. However, beyond the iconic theme, the show's architectural backdrop holds a connection to one of Hitchcock's most renowned films. The imposing Victorian Gothic mansion featured in an unlocked window is none other than the Bates House from Psycho, showcasing Hitchcock's adept use of sets and locations to create a chilling atmosphere. Delving deeper into the episode's evolution, the original ending crafted by short story author Ethel Lyne White took a different turn. In the climax, Nurse Cherry discovers the true identity of the killer, Edward Leakes, and takes matters into her own hands, pushing him to his demise. Yet, in the teleplay scripts, Hitchcock's influence is evident. The director suggested a gripping struggle between Nurse Ames and Nurse Crossan, adding a visceral element to the climax. This alteration, along with the revelation of Nurse Ames' intentional reveal, creates a chilling ending that adds to the suspenseful storytelling characteristic of the series. In these subtle details lies the genius of Alfred Hitchcock Presents. Hitchcock's meticulous attention to both musical and visual elements, combined with his knack for enhancing suspense, transcends the boundaries of typical television. The interconnectedness of sets and stories, as seen in The Bates House, exemplifies Hitchcock's seamless approach to storytelling across various mediums. The series, born in the mid-20th century, stands as a testament to Hitchcock's mastery, influencing not only television but also shaping the narrative of iconic films. Through these captivating facts, we glimpse into the intricacies of Alfred Hitchcock Presents, a show where every detail, from music to mansion, contributes to the enduring legacy of suspenseful storytelling. As we bid adieu to the mysterious world, masterfully woven by the 1955 television series that kept us on the edge of our seats, consider the tales spun by Alfred Hitchcock, a vintage labyrinth of suspense where every twist and turn left an indelible mark on the canvas of classic television. Now, let's take a moment, you and I, to delve into the recesses of memory. Did the eeriness of Hitchcock's narratives creep into your dreams? Or perhaps the uncanny plot twists lingered in the corridors of your thoughts? Share with us your most cherished recollections, the scenes that embedded themselves into the tapestry of your mind. In the twilight of Alfred Hitchcock's enigmatic stories, your reflections become the silent echoes of an era where suspense wasn't just a genre, it was an art form. The interplay of shadows and revelations, a dance that sparked curiosity and sent shivers down your spine. As we navigate the labyrinth of our own memories, let's invite others to join in. Share your favorite moments, unravel the mysteries that left an everlasting impression. Connect with fellow enthusiasts who, like you, found solace and excitement in the enigmatic world Hitchcock painted for us. Your thoughts, like Hitchcock's narratives, transcend time. So let the discussions commence and let the threads of shared memories weave a rich tapestry of appreciation for a series that stood the test of time. Thank you for indulging in this journey through the captivating realm of Hitchcock's storytelling. Your time and musings are treasures in this dialogue of shared experiences. 
Until we cross paths again in the realm of unforgettable tales, may your reflections be as intriguing as the narratives that inspired them.